Welcome back. So, I added a little corner cave here for the electrical generation. <clears throat> Sun's going down. Spread some torches around in the close vicinity. Ran down in the uh, cave system, grabbed a few more. Really need a redstone. And I think what we're going to do is we're going to and get ready for tomorrow. We're going to make a few things. Let's grab, let's see, what are we going to grab? Let's grab tin, copper cables. Ah, I need to leave those two there. Ah, let's make a bat box. And we have the other. I'm going to make some batteries first. One, two, three, one, two, three. We need three batteries. like so. These three batteries will place across the middle. One contact point for the battery box. Oh dear me. Little delay. Let's get some planks. Contact point and let's encase it in wooden planks. We get a battery box or a bat box. Now when you place a bat box Every face is an input except for one. The output has a round circle, which you can see in the default there, and the circle is placed facing you. So if I want the circle facing, if I want to place it there and face the circle that way, I need to stand over here to place the bat box. I want the circle facing down. I want the power to come down out of the bat box to the appliances. Let's see, one, two, three. If I place it up here, we should be good. So I'm going to put it there. Circle's right in the middle. Let's go ahead and connect our devices. Appliances. Our white goods. Now you can either aim at the um, wall. If you right-click the uh, bat box, you go inside of it. So you can hold shift. And that will allow you to place items on, on clickable items. So these are all connected now to the bat box. But guess what? The bat box has no power. What are we going to do about that? Well, I decided to go big. I had lots of stuff from the first time out. I'm going to grab eight iron furnaces, which I've already made, 24 refined iron, 16 electronic circuits, and eight RE batteries. And I'm short some items. Yeah, I think that's why I ran back down there and I just used all of my tin. Well, I've got more. Let's smelt some more. I kind of hate to do this. I've got some uh, scaffolding. Let's go ahead and throw the tin in the macerator. Oops. I don't need that much. How much tin am I going to need? I need eight iron for you know I could have swore. Maybe I don't need that. Hmm, I'm confused. Let's go ahead and make our generators. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, maybe I did make this right. Now it goes on top. The batteries. Yeah, there we go. Okay, eight batteries, 24 refined iron. Yeah, that makes eight generators. Wow. I'm really corn fused. Let's take that out. Okay. Best laid plans of mice and men. So, a solar panel. We need. Still need glass coal dust. Right. So the generator goes here. We're going to make eight solar arrays. Electronic circuits on either side. And get one extra glass. Like so. Glass, 
coal dust, we're going to make eight of these. Now the other thing we're going to do, we keep getting turned around. What do we need? We need this, this, and this. We're going to place the contacts, the core, and then finally the planks so we have an LV transformer. Put that in the middle, surround it by solar panels, and we have a low voltage solar array right out of the box. I like that. So we're going to go up on the roof. Now I'm going to go ahead and give myself a little bit of space for expansion here. to run cable here and then up and we're going to place our array next to that and make sure there's nothing above well except for the moon all right we'll take care of that in a minute now we have completely connected low voltage solar array. Of course it's nighttime, so we have no no power. This generator is really superfluous, but say at night I have to do something, I don't want to wait, which I could sleep, but say I don't want to wait, I could always drop some stuff in there. I'll take that out eventually, but it's there for now. What else do I want to do? I've got some stuff I'm holding back here, but you know, I'm gonna wait till I can start turning solar and grind up these these items. Got lots of rubber. Nice. All right. So the other thing I can make here. Let's see if I can find it. Is a saw. Now I've got plenty. Two iron and then two of the jewel. I don't have much in the way of um, diamonds yet. I found. Three? No, I found six. I mean, four. I found four. Let's grab, let's make a blue saw. We need two of those. And you say a saw. What's a saw for? Well, you'll see what a saw is for. Ha ha. We have three sticks, two iron, and two gems makes a sapphire handsaw. Very good. Now, what we'll do. So we're going to cut these cobblestone slabs into half and then we're going to cut them into half again and that makes panels let's take our panels and you see the interface let's switch to another item moon's going down it's gonna be day soon go to our panels and if you aim properly that's on the outside. I don't really want it on the outside. I thought I could do this on the inside. Hmm. I don't like that. Let's. Nah, let's not worry about that. Let's go downstairs. That's where I really wanted the panels anyway. Maybe I need to cut them again. Let's try to cut them. Let's cut them again this way. Yep, there we go. Covers. That's what I want. Now, if you place, if you place the items, once you cut them, if you place these to the side, it makes different shapes. So that's a really cool addition of uh, the mods that we have here. Uh, it looks like they're going. Well, let's place it anyway. That's supposed to. Wow. I don't really like that. It's okay. I don't really care that it shows anyway. I just don't like that placement. Get the panel back. Let's see, I can place panels on the inside. Place them across and the, the wire will actually pass through them. But to place them up in the hole...
Huh. Oh well, we'll leave it. So it's daytime. Let's see what our bat box is doing. It's charging. All right, let's macerate some stuff. Let's get rid of, let's get this gold out of here first and foremost. And we're gonna macerate a lot of stuff. And that should slow down the charging, but we're still gonna have an excess amount of energy. Hmm. We've got lots of copper ore. Good gracious, I got a lot of that. Silver, we can get our first silver. Let's put some of this away. Burn some tin dust up. And that'll bring our energy production down almost to a halt. We're still in a positive. We're still gaining. Running two appliances and still gaining. It's pretty good. Alright, so I think that's good enough for a short episode. I'm going to go ahead and mine some stuff or see what I've got. We'll, um, We'll catch up next time. We're we're taking these these are like baby steps here. And the reason is that there's so much content with these mods. You know, the obelisk over here, we'll eventually get to that. We've got all the crystals all over the stinking place. You know, not even talking about automation, geothermal, rail, railcraft, computer craft, all kinds of mods. We got all kinds of fun ahead of us, so just taking it easy. I hope you enjoyed a short video and uh, we'll see you next time. Aloha.